The reason I'm making a tutorial on this is because people don't show how to make the sea monster with teeth, besides bear traps. Hello guys, today, I'm showing you how to make a sea monster in Melon Playground with teeth. So let's get into the video. So first, you're going to want to get a box short. And next, you're going to want to resize it. Make sure to make it long and big, not too much though, or it will be hard to move. And now, we're going to get another box short, so we can make it long. Now, we're going to attach it to the other body. Make sure to use the one I am using to attach it, or it may not work properly. Now, we will attach it. Now, if you use the one that I used, it should work properly. Now, we're gonna start making the tail. So you're gonna want to make it shorter than the other, and keep making it shorter as we go along. Now we will attach it to the attached part, you get the point. Now, it shall work. Now, we're doing the last part of the body, besides the mouth. Now, you should have completed the body if you followed the steps correctly. Now, you're gonna want to pause time while it's in the air. And now, we're gonna be getting to the mouth. Now copy it. Now paste it. And now, we're gonna pin the jaws to the body. Now freeze the body, but not the the jaws. Now, it may look broken, but trust me, it's not. You gotta pause time in the right position.
And now pause time. And now reposition the jaws. It looks like we're gonna have to resize the body for the jaws. Now, it should be compatible. Oops, I unpinned it. Now, it's about time to add the teeth. So, for the teeth you're gonna want to get a knife. and follow as I go. We're gonna have to resize it again, but not too much. That should be enough resizing. And now, it's time to add the upper teeth. Now, copy this. And paste it. What? Oh, dang it, I messed up. Ugh, it'll be fine, but slow. Now also, be careful while adding the teeth, and make sure not to pick up the jaw by accident. Now, we're almost done.
Oops. Now, we have to attach the teeth to the jaws. Use this to attach the teeth. Make sure to use this one, or it may not work properly. Make sure to attach the teeth properly, and not the walls or background, or it will mess up. Now on pause. Time to see if the teeth are attached. Oh god, one is broken. But don't worry, it's pretty easy to fix. Delete the broken one. and add a fixed tooth. And now, it should work. Also, unfreeze the body. Now, and now, you should have your very own sea monster. Oh, and don't forget to save it so you can spawn it anytime you want. And now, you can title it anything you want. But I prefer sea monster, or just worm. And here's a demonstration. Anyway, I hope this helps some of you guys. Hope you have a great day or night. See ya in the next video.